Oh. 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 Nice. Oh, nice. <laughs> oh, bro. Nice. Here with my mate Reese. You may remember from such videos as fishing in the boat video. We got got some humongous fish. Well, we're here today. We're on a bit of an oyster hunt, and it's our first time at this location. And we haven't gone very far at all from our, from our car, and we've come across some humongous oysters so we are both pretty excited Rich has already had his first one as you can see and he's going to eat his limit and then pick his other limit so stick around if you like some oysters watching us eat oysters uh, it's going to be an awesome awesome day and yeah it's probably be one of the one of my most favorite days in a long time since I bought up video so just sitting on the ground, I came across this big beast. Look at that. There's oysters everywhere. Man, look at that one. So look at that, see? Look at that. Oyster number two. Oh yeah, bro. Mm. <laughs> nice, eh? Mm. Far out. Beautiful. So there's actually oysters just on the ground. Look, stuck around the tree. Some big ones around here. The one by just down by your foot. Look behind you. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Straight off the bark hey? of the tree. Far out. Oh, look at him. So we haven't gone very far at all, but look, there's some big ones down here, all stuck under there, under there. Right, I think Rich could open me up one now so I can have a taste. Yeah, bro, you leave that, uh, that one for me, bro. So I'll try that one, looks nice. Yeah, boy. Mm. Oh, 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 oh. Kill himself. We can do my do my knife. Yep. Oh, there it is down there. It's on the tree bark. I don't want you to hit a um, hit an artery. <laughs> it was a piece of venison. I'd have it frying by now. Oh yeah. Oh hell. Oops. Some people tell me you could put them in the freezer and um, the shells open up. I tried it. But that doesn't work. Oh, very, very lot of tree bark in here. Oh yeah. So that one just fell on the ground. I oh, mean, oh, fat ass. oh, look at that. Just broke. See that? Pretty. Oh, this one. Mmm. Oh, yeah. Mmm. Salty. Mmm. Far out, man. That's bloody nice. <laughs> well, I'm going to start picking some. Yep, there's a good, good size, eh? There's two on there. Yeah. Nice. Get the mangrove. So there are so many oysters around here. Look at that one there, just on the tree. Oh, it just fell off into my hand. That's a good sign. Now there's not much of an effort to get these either. It's... Look at that one there, you can find it right there. Look at that. So I won't show you guys where we are because I want to keep this. I 
this is like. Oh, man. Oh, look, you see, I need to look on that tree here. Far out. Look at that, there's some little ones on there. Oh, look at them all on the, on the ground. Far out. Yeah, look at them all. All stuck on these rocks. Oh, well. oh. Is that just one? I think one big clump full. <laughs> There's some stone there. Oh, I hear some. Hear some slooping sounds over there. Yeah. Ooh. Unfortunately, my mate here gets gout, so he won't last long. <laughs> I'm lucky I don't get that yet. Well, wow. nice, bro. Yeah, look at them all, see? Yes, so uh, we're going to stop and have a feed soon. My back's getting heavy. But this is an awesome spot. Absolutely pretty lucky to live here. Very lucky. So I wonder if you'll be able to um, bring your chainsaw down or chainsaw this tree. And <laughs> we'll cut the tree off. <laughs> take it home and I'll, and I'll grow it at home. Grow this at home. Take some photos, get out to the palmers. Hey, I want one of those oyster trees. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, here we are, here, an oyster tree. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> oh man. Far out. I'm going to come here every day, and every low time I'm going to come here. Pick out. The rest of my life. Something from the farm. Something extra. A bit of an extra kick or something. Or oh, extra size. Yeah. See, this is like a little more, a little more on there. See? Look at this nice oyster here too. See? Mmm. Bam. Mmm, that's bloody nice. Mm. Love oysters. Ooh. The old pippy. Well, they've been there for a while. It's a bit... Oh yeah, look at that. Ooh. You sound like me now. <laughs> Is that the sound of gout or... Oh yeah. <laughs> bro, look at that, bro. Oh, look at that. Far out. <laughs> you better give that to me. Try that one, bro. Okay, only because I'm filming. There you go. Oh, you're too kind. You sure? Yeah, go for it. See? Look at that, see? Looking after the Kaimatua. <laughs> There's a bit off that one. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that one better be the big, biggest one so far. I'm stuttering now. <laughs> Is that the first one I get out, stutter? <laughs> oh. Better get closer so you don't have to carry me. <laughs> mm. Man. Oh, yeah. Oh, look at him. That is creamy, yes. <laughs>
that one I had before, that was salty, that one. Mmm. Don't know, don't know about the butcher with the knife there. Mmm. Oh. Touch focus cancelled. My hand, look. Ouch. But I carry on. Battle scars. No, you just get enough for a feed, that's all you need. That's our motto. Enough for a kai and leave some for somebody else. That's right. You can find it on their own. <laughs> it'll be me and Reese again. That's somebody else. But if you guys, if you guys know where we are, I won't show you where we are, but we are at the Portuguese. You guys want oysters? That's where they are. Right over there. So we've just come driven all the way back around and now we're back in the harbour. We're just cleaning up the oysters, getting a few cockles, and then we're gonna have a bit of a feast of some venison sandwiches or venison rolls. That's to finish off our awesome day. Oysters and venison rolls. Doesn't get much better than that, does it? I'll just get out of this in. Yeah, not bad for the nice catch. Yeah, I ate them. <laughs> I'm going to be going to a thousand times to the toilet. <laughs> yeah. oh, what are those things doing? Did you eat all of those ones? That's part of your tally. <laughs> oh, this is the sole oh. survivor. The last one. I didn't pick those. <laughs> but I'm, I'm alright though. A few cockles as well. Yeah, they broke himself a few cockles. Look at that. Nice free harvest. Right time for a kawaitera. Kawaito pipea. No hekwe. What are they building down there? So, here is our venison back straps and some steak that the bro got. I've been venison for ages so we're going to cook that up on the old my favourite little tool is the my new new found friend. Man, I love using this. Awesome. Taking it with you. But easy as if you get it on. What I'm going to do there, put it over there, I'll just get up the, the old frying pan into our butter, you got to have your butter in it and our seasoning is just salt and pepper, that's all we're going to use salt and pepper right, we'll turn that on there's my light on there, there it is chunking me out the wind a bit About the bro's truck. Yeah. It's quite hard to see the flame on that. You can see it when you're bimming at home on the computer. On there. Look at that. How easy is that? Good old butter. Oh, 
Ooh, look at that. But it's good with most things. Right, so we're going to put the steak on now. Has it already been seasoned? Oh no, what's on there? Salt. Oh, okay. Oh, yep. Put that on. Man, I haven't had venison for ages. Looking forward to eating that. Put some pepper on there. A bit more salt. You can never have enough salt. Just put another piece on too, eh? That looks nice, bro. Ooh, look at that. That sizzle sound, that's what you want. Oh yeah. After a hard day, well not a hard day, but an awesome day, getting some oysters, you just, you know, you can't beat that. Look at that. It's a feast fit for a king, that. All right, eh? Mm -hmm. Just check the steak, the back steak, see how it looks. Yeah, but these things here, you don't want it to overcook. Want it a bit red in the middle still. Oh, look at that! Beautiful. Oh, you're gonna put more pepper on there. That side, a bit more salt, and more for good luck. Look at that, guys. Look at that. Back steaks, this part of the meat. Awesome. Well, I've got a little plate to use the thing board. You see that? That's how you do it. Right, here we are. I'm going to turn this off a bit and we'll get this, uh, those steaks there ready. Look at that. So I just cut it in half first, just put it on here, I'll just give it a bit of a knife there. Plate up. <laughs> yeah, plating it up. Look at that. Ooh. That's two for the bro. I'm going to have one because I'm uh, on a bit of a diet. And here comes a secret sauce over it. Put some of that on. Buttery gravy. On that one there. Oh, there you go. And there we have it. There is our venison back steak bread rolls. Yeah, I'll give it a taste for you guys. See what you think. See what I think. Nice. Mm. Anyway, too much in his mouth. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, too much in my mouth. Mm. Look, he's hungry. Look. Yeah, I do. It's a true food to swallow it. <laughs> so there we go. Venison, back steak, and rolls, butter, salt and pepper, 
that's getting much better than it does it. Well guys, that's the end of our adventure for one day. Me and the bro here, or Oyster Eater. This is a new name now. Actually, and Steak Burger Eater. The follow can hold the burgers down. Just like my man, he's just like, what the? Anyway, thank you all for watching, and we'll see you all in the next video. Who knows where we're gonna be? Who knows? Probably somewhere. So I'll catch you guys later. Hey, Reese. See you all next time. Here he is. It's Reese the Oyster Eater. <laughs>